Good morning, everyone. Hey, morning. so why do your eyes look like sleepy? Mine are like wide open. Because well, someone woke me up. Wait, we'll get to it. Welcome back to <laughs> another vlog with me, Seppi. And this is Rocky. His smile is equally as beautiful. If you watch my 10 facts about me video, then you would know that I don't really show the dog much, so I told Sol to hold the dog up so you guys can see him in the vlog. Did you say make sure you get my waist in? No, I was like, I'm gonna tuck this in so you can see I have a waist. You do have a waist. We're gonna go grab coffee and breakfast. I don't want breakfast. Might have something to do with the fact that I ate something at 5 a.m. But you guys didn't see that, so <laughs> it has nothing to do with that. Um, also, this rough outfit, like. So, we had to continue on my phone because my camera battery died, and I had to show you just how beautiful this outfit is. Um, yeah, I'm wearing Night Pro shorts, and then I thought I'd finish it off with some Chanel sneakers because I thought that, you know what? Maybe designer sneakers will save this outfit, but I promise you, there's nothing that can save what's going on <laughs> here right now. So I'm at uni with my friend Maya. Say hi. Hello. Um, Maya has just won an award. I haven't won it yet. They She's gonna win. The winner. They have Vote for Maya. So Maya is not only a fourth year oh, medical good. student, but she's also on the first women's first team for Spurs. Can I have your autograph? No. <laughs> it's alright, you're in my vlog anyway. So yeah. Literally, I'm so gonna, what is it called when they, I'm so gonna click make this like me and Spurs star and everything, like your face like all over. <laughs> but that is good. It'll be a good event. It'll be the Asian Achievers Award on the 14th of September. And also she's half Italian, half Asian. Yeah, I'm gonna take that my dad. I think they're gonna be thing. really confused. <laughs> Her dad's the Italian one, by the way. Yeah, because my mum went to the last event, so it's only fair. You just wanted to congratulate Maya Thank and you. make you guys a vote for her. So. It's not a vote, which is weird. It's All like right. a panel. Okay. A panel of judges. Panel, you best watch this and vote for her. <laughs> Soggy and I are in Selfridges. No, we're not in Selfridges, we're on the road. I don't know the name of the road. Okay, so we're literally opposite Selfridges. Oxford. No, not on Oxford Street. Oxford is right. Like okay, we're basically next to Wigmore Street. We're off Duke. We're off Duke Street. Okay, I'm getting all geographical for you and guys. And we're off to Val uh, Valentino. Right? Yeah, we're going to Valentino on Bond Street. I have to collect my bag from there, and we just thought we'd come, chill. Also, Soggy, show them how cute your hoodie is. Uh, how pretty is that? She got it from Forever 21. It's My so outfit is a bit of a co-ord. I'm wearing this jacket and skirt matching from Topshop. My bralette is Forever 21. And my boots are from Zara. I need to get a new memory card and I keep saying this but I'm going to eventually do it but my camera keeps cutting off because I run out of memory. How pretty is the weather today in London? It's like 23 degrees. How beautiful. This is one of my favourite places ever. We're on old slash new Bond Street. For you all this is my favorite street in London when I used to tutor if I had like if I was lucky enough to have a one-hour break in my day in my gap year I would come I would park close here and I would just like literally come and shop on the street or just walk and look at the window displays because this is like one of the most beautiful shopping roads ever and they put so much effort into the displays I really love it Mein Karas und Tam schon wieder da ohne Karas. So was cool. We've come to Elan. It's so pretty here and the food is really nice. Did you like your food? Good. I had the ciabatta sandwich and it was really nice. I recommend it. It was chicken, tomato, and mozzarella and had avocado on the side. And it was really nice. So it is currently 7 in the morning and it is 7 or 7.30. It is day one of my new placement on paediatrics and if you guys watch my 10 facts about me then you'd know that I really want to be a paediatrician. Sorry I'm talking fast because I want to get dressed quickly so I don't be late but my introduction starts at 9.30 um, and the hospital is about an hour and a half away um, so I have to get ready fast. 
So I thought I'd show you guys quickly my outfit for today. I think this is from h and I didn't look. Um, but my top is new from Zara. Um, and my skirt is last, I got last year from Zara um, in the sale. And I got it for about, I think, like £10. I always buy my workwear stuff from uh, the sale because I feel like it's, it's the kind of thing where it's not really seasonal. So you might as well benefit. Like, it doesn't change trend-wise, basically. So you might as well benefit from the sale. So, um, yeah, I got it from the Zara sale. And, yeah, I just feel like it's quite a smart outfit. I'm just going to wear these with ankle-length boots. It is... 6:15 p.m. so end of my first day and I love it I love pediatric so I'm so happy to be doing something that I love and I just saw so many different cases and it's just a whole nother dynamic with kids like it's it's pretty cool because you know you have to deal with the pa parents and then you've got pa kids who like you might be like to them stick your tongue out and they don't want to do it so you've got to find ways around that and just, I don't know, it's a really rewarding profession to work in. But now I'm just going to go and see one of my friends. We made plans to meet up just near where my uni is. And yeah. You guys, I'm so exhausted. I literally got home at like 11 o'clock last night because I went to see one of my friends straight after my placement. So I finished at about 6pm. Um, 6.30 I think it was. And I went to see one of my friends and it was literally only meant to be for an hour and we ended up chilling till about 10.30 and it took me an hour to get home so I got home at 11.30 and by the time I ate, like, ate food I was just like exhausted in bed blah 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 so I've literally slept for hours um, so I'm so so tired but you just gotta keep grinding guys what is this I'm doing? You can tell I'm already like very mad. Also, my voice is really gonna piss off everyone. Sorry about the morning voice. Um, is there a Postmates in England? Because I really could do with someone bringing me a Starbucks right now. Um, I have an espresso machine at home, but I've only got almond milk and um, my regular like cow's milk has run out. I cannot make coffee with almond milk. It splits. It's really weird, like even I've tried it hot, I've tried it cold, and it just doesn't work. I really need a coffee, and I won't have time to buy one on the way in. So, yeah, let me know if there's like a Postmate service. This is probably going to be like the fastest makeup you've seen in your life. I just literally dab my tinted moisturizer onto a beauty blender, and I dab it all over my face. So, guys, just wanted to say, Whatever your goals are, whether you're watching this at like 8pm or 8am or whatever, I hope that you have a successful week in smashing them. Make plans of how you're going to smash your goals and just do it. Motivation talk from Persian Bunny. Also, I know you're thinking, what is this t-shirt? It is a top from a charity that I love supporting called One Great Day. That was so hid. What is this? No next Effie. So it's from a charity called One Great Day, um, who I love supporting. They basically help out, um, they fundraise for Great Ormond Street Hospital. The recent thing they were fundraising for is for an echo machine for hearts, so babies with um, heart problems. So they do really great stuff. So make sure you check them out on Instagram. I'm gonna write it across the screen. So I get asked this every single day, um, every single day, every single video, what lip liner I'm wearing. So today I'm wearing Soft Spoken by NYX. You can't see it, but it's called Soft Spoken by NYX. And then I line it. And then in the middle of my lips, I put Carmex Moisture Plus Lip Balm in the color Cherry, I believe. And I literally got this like a year ago, almost two years ago from Superdrug. I didn't use it at all. And then I randomly like um, a couple months ago picked it up, started using it. I'm obsessed with it now. I just feel like it makes your lips so hydrated. And yeah, um, I'm thinking of doing a video of um, the lip products I use because I always get in my comments, have you had your lips done? And I'm like, no. And then people will be like, oh, so how, what lip liners do you use? 
um because i really just use like um natural colored lip liners to try and enhance my lips so um yeah if you guys think that would be interesting if i mention it in another video like go through the lip products that i use and stuff then let me know in the comments so now that i'm dressed i thought i'd show you guys today's outfit so this top is zara my skirt is top shot i'm gonna wear it with this jacket from h&m and i have like ankle boots to wear it with so so i just finished my workout i look huge in this mirror um but andy and i did some like hit exercises and now i'm going to go home and get changed i thought i wouldn't have time to get changed at home but i've got my stuff with me so i'm just going to go home and get changed i'm so out of breath i feel so unfit but i'm so happy that you're back because i need to get into shape so my hands shaking a bit i'm actually asthmatic and i need to take my inhaler before i go to the gym so obviously i just come from the gym so i've taken my inhaler um but i'm wearing like this crop top kind of bralette thing um, it's actually a sports bra, but it kind of comes up to here and I've only got this much belly showing So for me it counts as kind of like a crop top with these Topshop Moto jeans Some Zara um, strappy sandals. These were $29.99 I got them before I went away on my summer holidays and this Zara bomber jacket Which is in my Zara try on haul and my earrings are Swarovski and I'm just wearing some gold jewels to jazz things up. I'm a huge jewellery girl and I love just like quirky jewels so um, yeah that my my mum got me this one. Um, they always get me jewellery as gifts when they go away and stuff because they know how much I love it. Can we please appreciate that I left my room so you can't see the mess but you can actually see it in the corner of the shot. It's just my gym bag is on the floor and my clothes are on the bed. Christina was just telling me how she feels drunk after shisha. Does anyone else have that? Do you feel drunk after shisha? Do you feel a bit hazy? I'm tired. <laughs> She's I'm tired. It's 1am on a Wednesday because that's just how we roll when we catch up. I have nothing to do. I went to dinner with my friends and then I wanted to see Christina after because I'm not sure I'm going to see her the rest of the week. But she's my BFF. Oh, I love that. I love you. My voice is always so bad in the mornings. But I thought I'd show you guys my outfit um, today for placement. So this top is from Zara. This skirt, I genuinely have no idea where it's from. And these boots are brand new from Zara. I got these from London and I got this top whilst I was in Milan. And um, basically today I'm going to be in pediatric clinics. So it could be either like a speciality, like neurology. It could be cardiology, which I was in like two days ago or it could be um, just general paediatric, so it's really good but it just means I have to be up very very early and that's why my voice is super super croaky. I'm going to end the vlog here, I hope that you guys have enjoyed um, following another week in my life and seeing what I get up to and um, make sure you check out my socials, my Instagram is Persian Bunny, my Twitter is the Persian Bunny. And my snap is Seppi Samai. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe down below. Love you guys so much and I'll see you next time. Bye.